And finally, the World Cup has a way of bringing people together. That's certainly the case in New York's African communities, where supporters are throwing aside national affiliation and supporting the continent as a whole. CGTN's Nick Harper reports on the Senegalese and Nigerian fans who have something to celebrate. Now that's how to celebrate a goal. This is the passion and pride of the Senegalese fans, cheering their team on from afar. They're watching the match at the Senegalese Association in New York, right in the heart of Harlem's Little Senegal. Several hundred people from the West African nation live and work in this diverse neighborhood, and nothing brings them together quite like football. We are a football nation, and uh, you go to the streets of uh, Senegal and you see kids five, ten years old, playing out in the streets, making the ball out of, uh, out of anything. It is um, exactly like Africa oil, it is exactly like Senegal. So in New York, it is really like great for you know, African people because everybody is living here. And in New York, you don't have to go far to find a football-loving African community. The incredible thing about the diversity of the African diaspora in New York City is that you can catch a game with the Senegalese community in Harlem and then nip across town to drop in on the Nigerian community in Brooklyn. Super Eagles fans turned out for this must-win match against Iceland, joining to watch alongside other New York Nigerians. Even if we don't like each other, when the, when the, when the Super Eagles are playing, Everybody loves each other. Everybody loves each other. Far away from home, we're in Brooklyn, and then we can come together in the community to watch football. Like, everybody's here, not minding their ethnicity or anything. Football is something that unites everybody. But during World Cup games, even interviews can be interrupted. <laughs> and no matter your nation, if your team scores, the party starts soon after. Senegal, Senegal, Senegal. Nigeria and Senegal, who play their second match on Sunday, are keeping Africa's dreams of World Cup glory alive. Nick Harper, CGTN, New York.